going on, boys and girls? It's Monday. Uh, got a brand new episode of Skinny Boy Bulking. Yeah, it's Monday, so it's chest day. We're gonna get stuck into it, doing a mic'd up sesh. Got Dan behind the camera. So uh, yeah, looking forward to taking you guys through another week. Um, I think it's been three weeks since uploading the previous video. So yeah, a little bit's changed and I'll discuss further what went down the past couple of weeks. So let's just get stuck into this workout. All right, so as usual, starting off with the good old bench press, as you guys would have just seen in the chest day video that I just uploaded actually. So if you haven't seen that, go check it out because then you'll know what we're doing today. Incline bench press time, baby. Doing a balancing act right now, it's dangerous. <laughs> Doing it with 22s and a half, it's a PR. Right, I don't know if anyone saw that at the start of the set, well I paid the ultimate price for doing the balancing act. That motherfucker crushed my thumb. <sighs> that was good, it was a PR. What was it like nine unassisted? Third and finale set of the decline bench. Loki's scared of the superset. Last time I did it, my chest was sore for three days. That's a pussy mentality to have. This is gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun, baby. If y'all can see how sweaty I am right now, but this is how hard we work on Mondays. Let's go, baby. Last set of the day. All right, that is Monday done, y'all. Check this out, check this out. Five new PBs tonight on a Monday. We PB'd on um, the max volume for barbell bench press. We PR'd in weight and volume on the incline bench. So now it's 22 and a half for each hand. Uh, PR'd in volume as well for the overhead tricep extensions and for the very last push down as well. We PR'd in the three rep max. Apparently, I didn't even know that was a thing, but there you go. It's not bad for a Monday, cheeky five PRs. But uh, yeah, today's been a long day. Gotten a fair bit of stuff done, so pick up the camera tomorrow. We'll have a bit of a chat then, so see you soon. All right, ladies and gents, it is Tuesday today. Um, so let's talk about what has gone down over the past few weeks. So obviously it's been three weeks since the last episode. So within that three weeks, my weight actually didn't move very much. So it was stressing me out a little bit, but it's just something that will happen every now and then um, when you get into the gym and into bodybuilding. Instead of getting super stressed about it and super worried and caught up, I was able to diagnose the problem pretty quickly, but I didn't really drink much water. 
So although I was taking creatine, I didn't back it up with the right amount of water to actually saturate my muscles. So for the past three weeks, my weight was actually sitting at about 73 point, I'd say 73.0 to about 73.1. So I actually weighed myself yesterday and as of yesterday, I am 73.9. Yeah, that's all back on track now. So yeah, that's uh, good. And also since uploading the first video, I believe we're on a different program now. So that's always fun. It's uh, good to switch up your training program every now and then so you don't get bored and it adds a bit of variety to your workouts. And I don't know if I've told all you guys, but I am actually studying to be a personal trainer. So by mid-August, I'll be qualified for coaching as well. So I've started my own little uh, business page at the moment called Vels Fit. So if you guys wanna check that out, head over to the Instagram. I'll leave a link in the description as well. So yeah, I don't know if I'll be able to film much tonight because I might be in a bit of a rush, but I'll see how I go. Yeah, I might see you guys tonight. So I'll catch you then. Far out, so bright out here, but happy Wednesday, everyone. Uh, yeah, didn't actually end up filming training last night. As I said, I was in a bit of a rush and I didn't really feel like filming it. So yeah, I'm not gonna film every session anyway because does actually take a bit of effort setting up the camera in between shots and everything. So anyway, I'm um, just gonna film a few things for today. But uh, yeah, I think I'll just keep today's segment nice and short, but I just wanted to touch on something real quick. Something that I've actually really struggled with this week and I'm not really sure why is my appetite. I feel like I really just haven't been able to like, usually I'm pretty fine, but for some reason this week, it just feels like I'm really forcing food down and really not feeling good. Um, in between a lot of meals. So I don't know, maybe that means I need to dial uh, back a bit more on the calories, but but I mean, I'm still, I'm still getting it down anyway because reaching my goals is uh, super important to me. So whenever you guys run into roadblocks on the way to your goals, because there will be plenty of them, um, try not to let them get in the way and just stick to what you're doing as best as possible and uh, do anything it takes to reach your goals. So today's leg day, so you already know we're gonna have fun with that session. Uh, I'm gonna be training tonight after work because I finally got a shift. Also, your boy is now first aid and CPR trained. Uh, we did our course last night at class. So yeah, now certified for that, which is pretty cool. So that means I'm officially halfway through the certificate three. So it'll, not, it'll be another eight to nine weeks, I think. And then I'll have my cert three and then I'll just have the cert four to go and I'll be fully qualified for training. What up gang, hitting y'all with the iPhone cam, bringing out the iPhone cam. Comment down below whether the iPhone cam is a W or an L. Sorry, I'm so cracked off pre-workout right now. On the way to the gym, it's Friday, it's shoulder day. Um, I actually ended up resting yesterday, so I didn't film anything. Um, so back at it again today with shoulders and then tomorrow with my arms. The reason why I uh, prolonged my schedule for one day is because my father wants to work out with me uh, tomorrow so instead of having a rest day tomorrow I'm just doing arms whereas I would have done it on Thursday so yeah we got to the gym and then we're also going to the NRL tonight so I don't know how much of that I will be able to film but I'll try get a little bit of that on film for you guys as well staying at it staying consistent keeping on top of the diet hitting the calorie goals and nutrition goals every single day like I hope you guys are as well but uh, I'll pick up the camera back well Later. Boys and girls, I want to try and make this uh, relatively quick because I'm absolutely rooted and not the good type. But uh, in case you couldn't tell, I am sick as a dog. I've been sick for the past few days. It's currently Wednesday, the week after that this episode is supposed to be about. So uh, as you guys saw on the iPhone cam over the weekend, it was pretty busy. Um, ended up going to the NRL. Broncos won the game, so that was pretty cool. First time ever seeing an NRL match. And uh, yeah, i got to say, I enjoyed it. And then on Saturday, I hit arm session, which was the last session of the week, and I hit that with dad. And then kind of ever since Sunday, um, from Sunday up until today as well, 
I've been absolutely sick Monday and Tuesday. I was pretty much in bed all day. So I didn't really get a chance to tie off the video and I've been trying to wait until I was fully well, but it just hasn't worked out that way. So anyway, overall the uh, week that just went by, I'd say it was still a pretty good week. Still made uh, lots of decent progress towards our goals. So as of this Monday, which is a bit of a spoiler alert for the next uh, Skinny Kid Bulking series, we did actually just hit 75 kilos literally right before I got sick. So yeah, with that one being said, guys, hope you've enjoyed this one. I'll see you in the next episode.